squad, I was working my way through ring domination, or actually heroic, and got myself a wonderful Vanguard pull, which I'll tell you guys all about in a second, when this popped up. Yes. First of all, legacy cards coming back. Are you... S People would have been asking for this for ages, and we're going to have a lot of more information on that. And potential theories about what it means. Not just that, it's also got a brand new festive quest to chat to tackle. I don't know what it's gonna be. And we've also got Last Man Standing returning. This early? Are you kidding me? Really, Supercard? You, you couldn't have chosen Whatever, we'll get into details in just a second. But with all this content coming flying at us, there's one thing that I've forgotten. To address and I need to know from you guys whether you want to see it and that is the best and worst of all the tiers in season six you may have heard me mention a couple of names where they are roughly in the list so I want to know from you guys if you want to see a video dedicated to talking about the best and worst in primal vanguard and nightmare almost forgot it let me know by smacking the like button if we get over 1500 I'll do it. If we don't, then I'll leave it for these tiers and we'll just move on. Completely your choice, guys. All you gotta do if you wanna see it is hit that big like button. And obviously do it because you breathe oxygen and you exist. Because why wouldn't you? Subscribe to the channel and turn your notifications on whilst you are there. So, I got a bit of a sneak preview of this. I didn't get too much when I sat down and I previewed Supercard for season six and we were told that the event was going to be coming towards the end of the year but obviously being under an nda i couldn't say anything until they reached the news which they have done now and it does come across this one's actually going to include the fusion chamber now we've pretty much been aware that the holiday cars are going to be dropping soon anyway because if you remember they was a slight little sneaky reveal by the guys at cad daddy when they decided to drop random holiday sounds the jingles which you may or may not remember from the last couple of seasons on random cards now it seems like the ingredients are going to be from titan up to wrestlemania no it's not wrestlemania sorry goliath and then from if i'm not wrong gothic upwards it is going to be the card so i'm assuming they're going to cover off last year's cards as well Maybe there's to be some brand new cards, but it does seem that in some of these cards, and I wouldn't go as far to say that they're going to bring all the old cards back or some of the new cards back. What I think they'll do is they'll put them on new cards for you to collect. So there'll be like a difference in the image or something, or there'll be like no outline or something. This has been something that the community has been asking for for a long time, is the ability to get some of the better images that I might have missed from season one and season two, and now from season three. What levels do you think they're gonna go to though? Well, I can definitely see the, the first, well the first, sorry, the second PCC, which is Hogan. And Andre the Giant, I can definitely see Hogan's being available. Uh, names, I mean, they potentially could bring uh, throwbacks and Hall of Fames that have suddenly now gone out of uh, out of service. Maybe Rick Rude and the guys from WrestleMania Season 1, which were like available for a very short amount of time. Some of the fusions. Maybe they're going to be on the Legacy fusions, if you remember those, where you transfer them across and they're slightly different in terms of image. Man, it's exciting. And I'm guessing it's going to start tomorrow, or at least the ingredients are going to start tomorrow. Um, that's what I'm expecting. So you might see some big news coming then. Plus, they've got the new quest. I don't know what is going to happen with that. But maybe it'll be like the gobbledygooker and the fiend, where you have to collect certain uh, ingredients, a certain amount of certain ingredients, and then you get yourself like a card or a special card back or a free vanguard pull or a pull of your tier or something like that plus you've also got the <laughs> smile for the superstar debut in last man standing now a lot of theories about who it's going to be uh first of all uh the one i'm not gonna say because 
of the controversy around it. <laughs> um, but his uh, second name is Miles. I'm assuming he will not be uh, in because he's been released from WWE. So that's just not going to happen. Uh, there's Norman Smiley, who is a, a very re well respected uh, legend in WWE. He actually works at the Performance Center in Florida still. So he, uh, so now, not still, now. So it's definitely possible to bring him back in. Some have uh, laughingly said uh, Eugene or uh, Dr. Isaac Yankum, who was Kane's very, very bad gimmick back in like the. Ni early 90s if you want the 80s no it's the 90s which is that he was like a dentist with like really bad teeth so kind of like a horror character and the last suggestion which i think is more likely is probably doink the clown but we could be all wrong and it's someone completely different hopefully they'll release a couple of extra uh teases over the next couple of days before last man standing but i have to say it's probably the only time I hope it's the same as the last man standing last year where we had all the hardened cards and stuff or they've changed something to, to do with the difficulty because yeah, I'm not proing Hogan and Alexa is going to cause me many problems. Not to mention the fact that I've not, uh, <laughs> I've not trained any other prime or female so i'm gonna have a lot of problems if it's like the normal last man standing i pray to the supercar gods that they have changed it oh on that subject to the supercar gods we are now day two of our kylo riley event card cat daddy i hope you're watching because we want it we the community want the kylo riley event card i say we but you know me but you all want him right also have the one more bite packs now I did a couple extra the other day which is why you've seen my credits go down quite a bit and um i because i come back in the store today i thought i'd show you what i got and there were a couple of interesting ones in there so we opened three extra sets hope you guys enjoy i want to know in the comment section what you got from your most recent packs your free pack it could have been something great in the tpg pack it could be a pack you bought from the store let's go you know what? Why not? I don't know if I, I, I want to go again. Do I want to go again? Uh, okay, Brock Lesnar. That's not so good. <laughs> A little second tie around be better. Uh, Goliath to Vanguard. Two superstars. Bump! Two cataclysms. Okay, so this is going to be good for leveling at least. Beast and Goliath. Uh, all got some yams. We got some yams, people. So many yams. I, just, I don't I believe they're actually allowing people to do this more than once. Maybe it's because of the gobbledygook, or I don't know. Maybe it's because of the new tier coming in January. Oh, let's do it. Let's do this. Let's go. Okay, we've got our uh, Drew McIntyre, Universal Championship, and Fandango. It's leveling food right now. Two superstars at the Neon Vanguard. One time support Neon Vanguard. It's got a feeling this is going to be worse. Oh, shattered. Velveteen Dream. The Venice, it wasn't up until 7, 7, 8, and 10. I started getting Vanguards. One more bite. Oh, we've got four yams. Okay, that's uh, that's pretty damn good. We just need the, 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 tur the turkeys, the turkeys. One more bite. 7 of 10. Female. WrestleMania 35 to Vanguard and a one time support. Got Rhea last time. Okay, Becky Lynch and a SummerSlam 19 support. Oh. Did I not have that support? Fair enough. One, uh, one more bite with the one times Cataclysm to Vanguard. That's a big range. Uh, Matt Hardy. So the luck is not in my favour this time. Let's claim it. One more bite. Uh, another set of yams, but no... No turkey. Where's the turkey, guys? Last pack. One more bite. 10 of 10. One superstar. Primal to Vanguard. Has this been a complete waste? Well, it's not been a complete waste of time because you get a Primal. If I get a Primal female, that'd be great. But Vanguard would be just be anything that's a pro. One superstar, so it's not gender specific as well. Come on. 
Oh, the ghetto. The ghetto, the ghetto, the ghetto, the ghetto. The single. Oh God, is then you do it again? Someone has to tell me not to do it. No, we can do it. One more bite. Don't have ten. Let's go. Oh, oh no, it's a, it's a support, isn't it? It's not too bad. Vanguard support though. Uh, ooh, microphone. Nice. Okay, it's in two decks already, really? Okay, fair enough. That's uh, another Vanguard, that's four Vanguards out of these. Uh, one more bite, uh, two of 10. We're just gonna give it another go. Uh, another Vanguard note, we're gonna guess a Gothic and a Goliath. Goliath? Cataclysm, even? Beast of Goliath. Are we gonna get a turkey? Yeah, we got a turkey and a candy jam as well. Woo! Hopefully, we can get enough to get at least one more of those Gookas. Or if we get two more of the Gookas, at least we get the car back. This is gonna be two superstars from SummerSlam 18 to Vanguard tier. Let's go! Oh, it's terrible. Two SummerSlams and Neon. These are some of the best packs I've opened so far in, in Season 6. Uh, two, two superstars, Neon Vanguard. One support, Neon Vanguard. Let's go! Finn Balor, Becky Lynch, and a Universal Championship. This is the freebies again. i uh, got yams. More yams. And the, the yams are good. The, the yams are good. Right, here comes the female. Specifically a female pack, WrestleMania 35 Vanguard. You guys know the score. Is it gonna be lucky? Maybe primal though. That's a support. Paul Heyman. Not great for me, but maybe great for someone else. Cataclysm to Vanguard, any kind of superstar from those. So it's not gender specific. Ember Moon. Worst it could have possibly been. Okay, now we come up to the, the, the last pack. The last of the last pack. Uh, candy jams, another set of candy jams, and a turkey. Guys, we're, get, we're, getting the, we're getting the enhancements. Finally, we're getting the enhancements. Um, we're still not getting the enhancements in here though. We'll probably get these because my credits have gone down from like 30 down to this. So it's kind of depressing. When are they gonna make him free, man? It comes the last one. One time superstar, primal to Vanguard. Uh, so far, not been great. We did get a, a, a Vanguard support, so. Got a hope. Is it going to be good? Robert Rude is a pro. At least, that's good. Is it a pro? Yeah, it is a pro. Okay, so we got, we got Robert Rude. Damn. It's just, it's just it tempting me with these one more bite packs. I know, man. Do I could, just, do I keep going? Do I keep going? Because it gives me the, the gobbledygooker stuff. <sighs> you know what? Let's do it. More one more bites. Uh, that is uh, microphone, and Brock Lesnar, two Goliaths to Vanguards males. Ah, Summer Sam, Andrade. And Xavier Woods. Just need more yams and more turkeys. That nah, was not a yam or a turkey. Why do I feel like the game is just like, yes, keep coming. Oh! Guitar. Loving the guitar, Rusev and Xavier Woods. So far, your boy Xavier Woods is uh, is interrupting this pack opening. Cataclysms. Flash Morgan Webster. At least this is going to give me a lot of leveling fuel for a while. Three packs again. Uh, turkey! Woo! Almost at, we're, God, we've got to have at least five turkeys now. At least five turkeys? Here comes the female pack. Ah, Summer Sam 19. Charlotte Flair. One time superstar. Come on, game. Sting! This is a season six card. Oh, that's a level two. Yes, level two tier. Nice. 
Uh, oh, yams. More yams. More yams is always good, yams. One more bite. 2,500. Is it going to happen, people? So far, we've got two primals and one vanguard. Let's go. Didn't say that at all. That is a pro. Okay. You know what? Consider all things considered. These are actually quite good value. So that's fortify level one. Fortify level two. He's going to be really, really strong. I'm definitely not trying to <laughs> train the way that Kylo Riley though. Uh, so that's going to be all close, close, not close enough though. Universal Championship. Yeah, one more, one more WrestleMania. There we go, Fortified Level 2. Damn, his stats have gone up big time. I like it. I like the fact that he's OP as hell. I mean, he kicks Randy Orton's ass. Damn. I mean, so, I opened the extras. I opened the extra packs. And you know what? It's pretty good. It's pretty damn good. I'm happy with what I got anyway. So, if you open any yourself or any of the other packs, let me know in the comments down below. Um, maybe went a little bit OTT of it, but I thought, you know what? These are the best packs I've opened so far. I mean, I'm sorry, but you, you even the, the first set of Vanguards would have been way worth the rest of it. So, uh, yeah. I've been Super Summon God Barbecue. You've been awesome. We have just had a ride and a half with these uh, crazy, crazy packs. And make sure you're liking the video, subscribe, turn your notifications on, all that jazz. Leave your comments down below, and I'll see you in the next one. But I never